Hello, and welcome back to this playthrough of Samurai Warrior Spirit of Sanada. I am Scutlist, and here we are in Osaka Castle as adult Yukimura. I didn't take the time to call attention to it in at the end of the last episode, but I think that adult Yukimura is actually a pretty cool looking design. His outfit appears to be pretty much what youth Yukimura had been wearing earlier in the game, just with a cape added, but... Yeah, I think this is a really good outfit for Yukimura. Anyway, we have to go talk to Chacha up here. While Yukimura has changed his design, Chacha has con con continued to look the way she had previously. I guess Koei Tecmo doesn't believe in the existence of women who look like they're 30 or older. But anyway. Chacha-sama. ご無沙汰しておりました。来たのですか、雪村。はい。お約束通り必ずチャチャ様をお守りいたします。約束など。は。軍議が始まります。急ぎなさい。もうちょっと喜んでくれると思ったんですけどね。あれじゃまるで初めて会った頃の。軍議に行ってまいる。まずは機内を制圧し、その上で正常する徳川の軍を迎え撃つべきと存ずる。バカな。わざわざ撃って
そうして案じてくださるカイドのがそばにいてくださりチャチャ様も心強かったことでしょうダメよ私なんて全然力不足おや熊姫が珍しくしようらしいうっさい関ヶ原の後ほんと見てらんなかったんだからチャチャ様はそれ以来誰に対してもあんな感じだから真田の承知しています今度こそチャチャ様を必ずお守りするよしよく言ったそれじゃあこれまでのご無礼をお詫びします真田幸村様どうかよろしくお願いいたしますおうおやめくださいカイトロそのようないえけじめですから共にチャチャ様をお守りしましょうはいOkay, that was our talk with Kai.、Um, did you see the way Sasuke was animating for quite a bit of that, cu that cutscene? I'm not sure if that was done inten intentionally to, to suggest he was bored of the conversation or if that was some kind of error in the game. But anyway, we have more shining dots to be seen too now. Okay, our next shining dot is over in the training dojo. Uh, Mori Chika, Moto Chika's own son. Uh, so long as I'm in the training dojo, I'll mention that once Yukimura became adult Yukimura, he was able to learn quite a few new attacks from, from this thing right here. So we may be able to look at that the next time we, we get to a fight. Anyway, one last shining dot down here. Okay,、uh, I see the sign right up there on the center path.
Okay, uh, I was hoping we'd be going straight to a multi-stage battle, but we have another exploration map to do. And we need to talk to Sasuke. Based on that conversation, I think I'll be taking Sasuke to this exploration map. And considering Sasuke's level, I should probably take the game off of Nightmare difficulty. Okay, that little delay taken care of, let's get to this exploration map. Mount Sh Shigi Shigi. Anyway, a level 99 Yukimura and a level 40 Sasuke. Osaka Jo ni nakanaka chikazuke nai jotai da ga. Okay, can, since, it, since it, this is just hard, hard difficulty in respect to Sasuke's level, it also means no enemy here is going to be able to really threaten Yukimura. But then again, exploration battles generally aren't too exciting in the first place. Alright then, Adult Yukimura has some new at attacks up his sleeve, so let's take a look at them once I stop bouncing around from bombs. I'm liking these new attacks. Anyway, where's Sasuke? He's up here. I guess the developers wanted him to really de deserve his title of greatest soldier in all of Japan because this is... these are some great attacks. Anyway, uh, I guess we can go this way. We'll see if any if there are any fireball soldiers down... yeah, right here. Let's take care of what business there could be down here, just so we don't have excessive backtracking. Let's see if his Muso attack has changed any. I'd say that it has. Hmm. 
Well, I'd say the only complaints I'm having about Adult Yukimura so far is... Well, I can see the way his lance keeps clipping into his cape as he's running. I'm not a big fan of... of... Constant, constantly looking at graphical clipping like that. But oh well, maybe if that antler costume DLC becomes available here in the West, I'll buy that to solve the problem. Hold on. Man, fireball soldiers are annoying. Okay, that's seven of the named fireball soldiers. I still need to find another nine. Okay, let's ignore him for now. Let's see if there's any fireball soldiers in the next area. Okay, that's 15 out of 16 fireball soldiers. Some conch shells, too. And where would the last one be? Actually, hold on, let me check something. Looks like no changes to his hyper attacks. I was thinking maybe the last fireball soldier would have been down here, but guess not. Let's turn around. A small bit of backtracking, but I can only assume the last fireball soldier is somewhere down this way. Let's see, one Muso attack should be all it'll take. My, he looks to be fairly resilient. Okay, that takes, takes care of that. Let's continue on. Let's see, these are supply soldiers, not fireball soldiers. Okay, one of our... Exploration objectives taken care of. We still need to find that last fireball soldier, though. Hold on. 
doesn't look to be anything around here. And I can't go in that direction, so... Huh, did I miss someone? Ah, yes, this... I uh, this must have been the one I missed. ジュグナリオの弾薬が集まったな。これで目的も達成できよう。こんなにたくさんの弾薬どうすんのさ。量多すぎじゃない。いや、ちょうど良い量だ。早速戻ってデマルを完成させよう。Okay, a bit of unnecessary backtracking at the end there, but that takes care of another exploration map. And hopefully I'll, I'll have an excuse to put the game back on Nightmare difficulty pretty soon. On regular hard, I feel like I didn't get a chance to really test Adult Yukimura's new moves. Anyway, we need to report our success to Sasuke here. Osakajo Okay, looks like we have a traitor to find, but we can do that next time, I think. This will be a fine time to end the video. We have built the Sanada Maru. As a bit of trivia, Sanada Maru was the subtitle of this game in its original Japanese release. Spirit of Sanada is something they came up with for the Western release. But anyway, that will wrap it up for this video. Next time we'll see what's up with that signpost I can see on the map. So until then, I hope you enjoyed this, and I hope to see you next time.